We are because of you. Post your videos and messages on Facebook, Twitter or Instagram starting hashtag we are because of you. You know I call you my Oprah mom, my Kris Jenner, and that's because you're my number one cheerleader teaching me how to trust myself 100%. I love you, girl. <laughs> Not only was I blessed with my own mother, who is just all around perfect, but also I have two incredible grandmothers, and I have such amazing best friends. Happy Mother's Day to all of you. We are because of you. Welcome back to Afternoon Express and oh, I love this campaign, we are because of you. Now a woman is like a flower, each one, uh, each personality is beautiful and unique and I'm standing here with Blomvoy and he is literally amongst these gorgeous flowers and the most gorgeous flower though mm -hmm. is his mom. <laughs> and of course you collaborated with Woolworths this yes. Mother's Day to bring us a beautifully designed flower paper that you're going to be showing us and there's three different wrappers for three different women in our lives. So this is absolutely genius and uh, we're of course going to create a table that arrangement or two for our dinner table a little bit later but thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you for having us. I mean flowers are obviously your first love but why do you think it makes the most perfect gift for Mother's Day? I think it's because it's something that is um, so precious um, because mm. it's fresh and because it's perishable it's something that gives a sort of unspoken luxury to the idea of gifting which I, I really always love and admire oh, about flowers. I love, love flowers. Now, Mum, I believe you knew from a very, very young age that your star over here just had a passion for flowers. I heard that you went to go and fetch him from boarding school and, and <laughs> like, I think that was your apparition, knowing that he was going to be the superstar that he is today. What happened that day? Yeah, he phoned me. He was in um, Grahamstown in a hostel, yeah. boarding school. So he phoned me early that week, Monday, Tuesday, very excited. Um, and he was like seven years old at this stage. No, no, he was a bit older than that. Yeah. But he said he's got a surprise for mom. Yeah. And on Friday I went to fetch him and he had this bunch of tulips. Now, he's not so old, but tulips weren't as common then as they are now. And um, as we traveled to our home in Bedford, 90 kilometers was hot and the tulips just opened and opened and opened and this little face just went down, down, down. Oh. So by the time we got home, they were... But I, I will never forget that. I mean, this, that was Mum's treat, so... Oh, a terrible was... florist in the making, right? <laughs> <laughs> not at all. No, not at all. <laughs> OK, so what do you recommend we do for Mum this month? So what day? I wanted to do with this particular arrangement, and it's a, it's a nice mix of almost everything. So yeah. we've, we've got um, uh, the... Uh, orchid plants in there, yeah. um, which will obviously last you months and months. Um, and then I've added some moss to it, which will also last. And then what I want to do is to mix flowers and fruit, which gives us a I very think that's nice genius. and I've abundant just seen you sort put of the feel. Pears in now. That's so um, smart. So, and it, I mean, the most beautiful fruit available this time of year berries, these beautiful brown pears. Um, so it's really going to give us a sort of Dutch still life kind of feel, and it goes so well with the beautiful European menu that we've concocted in the kitchen so it's something that you can literally add anything to the secret of course to not make it too high for the table <clears throat> but it's something that you can really keep adding on to you can even eat from it if you want to so it's a it's a lovely um, surprising way of putting it all together you know what I actually I'm just so envious of having like a skill like yours because you've literally as we've been speaking I've seen you just throw in a few little things and it just looks amazing I don't know I had to add no, <laughs> all I, I those. Think, um, if the same ingredients, it would look so good. It's about the experiment and sort of seeing what works for you and how it works for you. And I think that was also the idea with the paper. So you can really find a mood that sort of works well for your mom. Um, and it's something that, um, that speaks differently to each individual. And also, from what I'm seeing here, Willie's has got the most amazing variety of flowers. Like Incredible I'm looking at that stuff. white protea. Wow. Um, yeah, so, I mean, the most wonderful things that you can find and the flowers last well and the quality is always great. So it's something, I'm just going to turn this around so we can sort of look. Oh, These spectacular, incredible, right? spectacular white proteas. Wow. So it's something that we're just going to build onto. There's no formal rule or um, set guide that you have to follow. And I just think it's an unexpected little twist on it that we sort of added to it. And then we've got our paper that our yeah. flower is going to be wrapped in for Mother's Day. What are the three different options so that we, we have? So we worked on three wonderful genetic... Or, uh, 
characteristics. Um, warmth, which is a wonderful sort of, you know, mm -hmm. I give. And um, then the next second one is inspiration, which I think is applicable to so many moms. And then the last one is strength um, or strong, which, oh, which that's is something nice. that's sort of a slightly more bolder sort of personality trait. Mom, what's your favorite flower? Without I thinking about it too long. I don't <laughs> think he's got my very favorite here, but yeah. if I have to choose here, yeah, would be the roses. Oh, I love roses. Mm. So, I mean, my mom's an artist and I don't have any of her paintings in my house. So the fact that Blomboy is Blomboy, how <laughs> often do you get do you get sent flowers to your house from him? <laughs> Unfortunately, we live uh, far apart. Yeah. Not quite far, but um, when he visits. But whenever he can. There's always something in the house. Exactly. Do you guys have anything special planned for Mother's Day? Well, we have my grandmother here. She took part in the Woolworth campaign with us and she turns 94 on wow. Monday. Monday. Yes. Lovely. So it's That's a really special, special special day for us. Oh, Lord. that is going to be very, very special. Well, we wish you a happy Mother's Day, Mom. Thank you. And thank you so much for creating. I mean, look how beautiful that setting is. Oh, that's going to be coming home with me today after the show for sure. So if you are looking for a way to tell that special lady in your life, I love you, try adding Woolies flowers. So to celebrate this Mother's Day, get a personalized bunch of flowers at Woolies on Saturday the 11th and Sunday the 12th at Eastgate, Canal Walk, Santon and Gateway. And tune in tomorrow to catch Alvain making a beautiful, personalized bunch of flowers for moi. <laughs> <laughs>